For this activity, you will need two styrofoam cups, masking tape, a Sharpie, and a brown Crayola marker. Our first step is to take the two styrofoam cups and place them bottoms together. And then we're gonna tape that to make it stay. Take your time, there's no right or wrong. Just make sure that you get both parts of the cup in that tape. And if you have to go over again, that's fine. If it's wrinkled, it's even better. It'll make it look a little bit more um, authentic. Next, we're gonna take our masking tape and make strips of tape all the way around the cup. Be sure to overlap the tape so you don't see any cup in the inside. And it's okay if it crosses over. I'm just going in a circular motion here and making sure that I've covered everything. Once we've completed covering our drum with the masking tape, I like to go around the rim and cover one more layer of masking tape to give me a smoother finish for my decoration. If you'd like to do that in the middle as well, feel free. Our next step is to take our Crayola marker, the brown one, and all you're gonna do is throughout the drum, you're just gonna color over the tape and take a cotton ball or a paper towel and just smear that in to give it a nice animal skin look, like so. Once you've completed the rubbing with the brown marker, you're gonna take your Sharpie and make any designs you want along your drum. And then you have your African drum figurine. Enjoy.